Hey everyone, welcome to my Rise and Grind morning routine for lazy people who want to be productive. The first thing I recommend is waking up in the morning. If you don't wake up in the morning, well, how are you watching this video? Are you dead or alive? Are you in heaven or are you in hell? Leave a comment below. I would love to know. And then I usually go back and forth between, yeah, I'll get up. No, I won't. And then I finally get up and I do 129 jumping jacks. I'm kidding, I never do this. Also, can we appreciate the angles? I'm a cinematographer. Oh! Simone is pondering. Bonjour, monsieur. Little town, it's a quiet village. Occasionally, I do get out of bed immediately, but usually I don't, and like most humans, I like to hit snooze. And when I hit snooze, I have an excuse. I go and find my favorite affirmations, and I listen to these in the morning to penetrate my subconscious mind. I have multiple rich and generous boyfriends who give me a large amount of cash monthly. I have multiple rich boyfriends who fall in love with me quickly and want to marry me. Rockstar affirmations, I have multiple rich boyfriends is my favorite affirmation to listen to recently because, um, I mean, the title of it says everything you need to know. On top of that, it truly has been working because yesterday I woke up to an email from the Elon Musk and you know what he said to me? He said, Dear Simone, I'm leaving Grimes and my baby with the weird name. I found your YouTube channel and I realized you are my soulmate. I have written you in my will and I'm leaving you my empire. Because I'm going to pass away one day, I want to spend the remainder of my time and money and fortune on you. It is my calling to do so and I'm answering the phone. Love eternally, your Elon. If you're new to my channel, that was obviously a joke, but I do really like to listen to affirmations and frequencies in the morning. You can check out my Spotify for that. Anyways, now I take cod liver oil because it's really great for your immune system and your skin, and I do suffer from hormonal acne around my jawline. I find no matter how great my skincare is, it just doesn't really go away. Because I have high androgens and I eat a lot of sugar. We have to meditate. So I set up my pillows on the floor and I do a really quick meditation. Sometimes I'll do a silent one and if I'm feeling mentally stable, which I haven't lately because I haven't really been doing that much spiritual stuff and I've been losing my connection to my king Joe Dispenza because instead I've been worshipping Stars Hollow and my queen Lorelai Gilmore. Anyway, I digress. If you want to know more about meditation, well, watch my other videos. Fine, I will tell you why meditation is good, but you still should go watch all of my other videos. I want money. But meditation in the morning is just really good because it clears your head for the day and it just gets you ready for the day, as opposed to immediately checking your phone. I actually purposely leave my phone in another room so in the morning I don't immediately go and check it, which I usually do as you can see here I'm battling. Do I check my phone and read all my hate comments and then hate myself the rest of the day or do I not check my phone? Oh, it's so enticing. Turn away girl. Thank god. She is so brave. Imagine your mind is a glass of water and let's just say it begins at being half full. Now, when you meditate, you can add another, say 200 mils of water. So now you got a glass with more water in it. Now, when you finally consume social media, let's say social media is some like red coloring, that's gonna dilute the water a lot, which basically means you can be consuming all of this negativity and bad things for your brain during the day, but because you meditated, you won't be as affected. Let's say you don't have that added 200 mils of water. You wake up in the morning, you immediately check your phone. You don't have that clarity there, so you put the red food drops in. That water gonna be red as hell now. And yeah, that's why I meditate in the morning, because it really, really helps me a lot. If I don't do it, 
I cry. Anyway, then I make my bed because a clean bed is a clean mind and a clean mind is a clean room and vice versa. Anyways, then I get my plates and I walk down my filthy corridor filled with my roommate staff. Literally, imagine walking through here drunk or after eight hours of watching Gilmore Girls. I can't see shit. I'm falling everywhere. And the kitchen, well, I live in central Sydney, so it's very small. And once again, filled with my roommate stuff. I live in a storage room. What the hell? And then I eat my very healthy breakfast. Oatmeal, milk, pour that milk girl, put it in the microwave, drink some water, water is so important, and then I stumble back through this dark, dark corridor, and I go and do my skincare routine. If you haven't seen my acne video, I talk about one of the main factors which cleared up my skin and it was having a simple and consistent routine. Emphasis on both of those words. The great thing about yours is that the software analyzes your skin type and adjusts the ingredients to specifically what you need. Also, all of the products are made in Switzerland, so you're getting luxurious products at an affordable rate. These products really helped my skin just normalize the oil levels, get rid of hyperpigmentation and control my acne. I'm using the Cloud Foam Wash right now. Yours contains no harmful ingredients and it's ethically sourced. So it's a minimalistic routine designed according to your skin, lifestyle and environment. If you suffer from acne, this is perfect for you because one of the main things that can aggravate your skin is using too many different products or products which aren't actually good for your skin. I really found that using this daily for the past few months has evened out my skin tone and made it more glowy and just helped control my breakouts. The routine consists of a day and a night personalized skincare set which has a day serum and a night serum and a day cream and a night cream. By having a consistent routine that is tailored to both your skin, lifestyle and climate, you will be reducing external factors which can contribute to your bad skin. Yours takes care of that for you so I highly encourage you guys try it and you can use my code SIMONE for 15% off your personalized skincare set. I know y'all get questions about this, so yes, I still do use my aloe vera and almond oil after my skincare routine. I do this at the last step at night time. On top of that, I do get breakouts around my ear and my jawline, and I do think it's hormonal because no matter what, I always get it. And I think it's because I have higher androgen levels. My problematic areas, which are usually my cheek and my forehead, yours kind of took all those breakouts away and I don't really get breakouts there anymore. At the end of my routine, I do like to brush my teeth, but if you're a very specific man watching this video, you know who you are. You might be a little bit confused by this step in my routine. I digress. So after all that, I usually try to journal in the morning and I'm honestly not really one for journaling because I hate writing. The only thing I write about is the trauma my ex-boyfriend gave me. If you open up my Notion, there's at least 100 journal entries about him. But anyways, like the phoenix I am, I have overcome that situation now and I'm beyond it. No hard feelings to him. Donda, donda, donda. Donda this, donda that. Donde esta my espanol skills? I haven't done espanol in a really long time. I should really add that to my morning routine. And then I read, not this particular book. I just really want to aggravate some people. While I eat my breakfast, I do like to watch YouTube videos on something educational, usually manifestation. With Joe Dispenza, my god. So I said, If a lot of people love each other, 
the world would be a better place to live. Roman Roman vacation. Abro. Abro. Puta, mi hada madrina dijo que sí Este de aquí me hizo llorar Este otro me dice marica Este otro de mí piensa mal Esto es lo que hago cuando me chingan Voy a encerrarlos bajo la tierra tierra Nadie va a comer y de hambre morirán Madre quiero saber En verdad quién soy yo 